faith in God. I, I can't, you know, sit here and talk about my entrepreneurship journey without mentioning, you know, the person that sustains me. The fact that I'm sitting here, the fact that I'm breathing, he's the source of all my creativity. I, I don't know if this will get played in the classrooms or not, but for me, I, 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 had to, I have to mention it. And, you know, when I look at, you know, where I, where I came from, you know, how I grew up um, and where I'm at now, like somebody is, has given me great health. Somebody gave me the work ethic that I have. And so I give all, all glory to him. Um, even throughout this whole journey, like, he, like where, where does creativity come from? Like, he's the one, he gave me the idea for Go Oats. And even, even as the company continues to grow, like, every day, like, so I, I never go a day without praying and asking God for wisdom and, and guidance, like, to, to help, help, help me prepare for the obstacles that I'm not even aware of yet. One of the prayers that I pray a lot is, hey, God, like, if, I, if there's a door, if there's an opportunity that I'm not supposed to be walking through, close it. And so if the deal doesn't happen, I don't get bitter over it. it. It may just not be the right time. And so trusting God and knowing that he has what's best for me, because how many of you know, like a blessing too soon is no blessing at all, you know? And so I trust that, A, that he's going to give us what we can handle. Because sometimes it's like that little kid that's knocking on the door and they want to they wanna step outside, but the parents won't open that storm door because they know that he can't, the kid can't walk yet, and the kid doesn't know that there's a step that they're going to fall over when they get to the other side. And that's how the relationship with God works. Like, he knows, like, what's on the other side. And so, trust, like, trust that. Um, one of the big things is, like, Shark Tank. I didn't even want to go on Shark Tank because our sales weren't where they were supposed to be. And I just, I just felt like, hey, this is what we were supposed to do. Um, the producer reached out and finally I, I, I emailed her back. I was like, okay, you know, we're in the middle of COVID. Let's just do this thing. And I'm like, God did that. Like every time, like we have zero marketing budget right now. We have zero marketing budget right now, but every time Shark Tank airs, guess what it does? 200 new followers, uh, increase in sales, which is more important than followers, by the way. Uh, but he, he, he did that, like, and, and, and so I, yeah, I, I can go on and on about all the different um, ways in terms of, like, how my faith has helped propel me and the company forward, but if, if you don't have one, like, I, I highly recommend it, uh, um, a relationship with him, and, and so that's been part of uh, my success.